What's up, guys and gals? Uh, I haven't made a video in a while, so I just kind of would figure I'd make one. I've been wanting to make one for a while, but just kind of didn't have anything to, that I wanted to kind of do. I wasn't, didn't have any ideas what to make a video on. Well, I got a, a game yesterday from Limited Run. It finally came in, and uh, there it is, Blasphemous the physical copy I finally got it in after ordering it in November it's a pretty good uh, pretty good physical version it comes with a card that's pretty awesome and the back says limited run there's also a little comic which is pretty cool haven't played it too much yet. I've just kind of tried it out, but I really love like the gothic, dark themes and the religious, uh, the religious, you know, um, imagery and things like that. I just think it's really cool. And I don't have internet set up at my house. I have to use like my phone's internet to do the videos and stuff because I'm kind of on a limited budget because I work at AMC a Movie Theater in Tennessee. And I don't get paid that much. So right now I'm just kind of doing that. Trying to get myself situated with like my life. And get my life straightened out and stuff. Because I was uh, on drugs for a long. I was uh, on prescription painkillers for a long time. So and uh, I've only been like. I'm not really technically sober really. Because I'm on methadone still. But I'm not on. I'm not, I'm not doing drugs like I was, and I'm just taking my methadone, and I'm going, like, down on methadone now instead of going up, so I'm kind of, like, leveling off and feeling a lot better, and I'm trying to move down to get off completely so I can be completely sober. I call it, like, medically sober because I'm not abusing the prescription drugs I was abusing anymore, and my life has gotten a lot better and I'm thankful for that, and everything's going good, it's just, uh, <clears throat> I really can't get a better job until I get pretty much off the methadone completely, I don't think, uh, so I, I work at my movie theater job, because I got a lot of leeway with, like, if I'm not feeling good, or if I'm getting sick, I can leave early, and I can not come in on certain days if, like, I'm feeling bad or whatever, so it's pretty good pretty good job it's like very lenient and i like that and i kind of need that right now uh i can't deal with too much stressful stuff right now uh i can handle a lot of stuff but not too much right now you know uh but there's the there's the uh sorry there's the disc it's pretty awesome i just love this blasphemous game it's just awesome i just love everything about it uh there's like kind of like a map of like the uh i guess the areas you go to in the game of uh sistodia Cis i guess that's how you say it it's pretty awesome and uh let me put everything back and I was just kind of going to just do like a, kind of like what games I was playing. Kind of like a video of that. And I got, I got, I'm getting Fury 2 from Limited Run. Uh, but I didn't buy it from Limited Run itself. I bought it from some guy on Amazon. But the Blasphemous game is number 304. That's my number. It's uh, 304. Right there. So I thought that was awesome. And I got Death's Gambit. Uh, heard good things about it. Some Metrovania, kinda, with a little Dark Souls mixed in it. And I love me some Dark Souls. I love me from, from Software is like my favorite game company. I love them. I love Sekiro. I have, I have all the Dark Souls. I got uh, Demon Souls. I have Sekiro. I got Metal Wolf XD. Uh, Metal Wolf Chaos XD. I got that. Uh, I just love From Software stuff. And I got another kind of little cool game. Labyrinth of Refrain. I haven't played it yet, but it looks kind of cool. It's like an RPG kind of. It just kind of looked awesome. It's just one of them weird little Japanese RPGs that I, I really love. I 
I've also been playing some Neo. I haven't never beat it yet, but I'm 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 getting there. I I'm, I take turns playing, swapping out games, and here and there I just take my time, whatever I feel like playing. You know, I got Battle Chasers, Night War. Yeah, Night War. It is an awesome game based on the comic book Battle Chasers. I actually bought the whole anthology because of this game. It is awesome. Battle Chasers is a good book. If you ever want to read a good comic, it's Battle Chasers. Especially if you're in like sword and sorcery, D&D kind of stuff. Battle Chasers is a good comic for you. Of course, they got Sekiro, but that's not a newer game. I'm just That's just something I play every now and again. I just got to leave Sekiro on my area of games that I'm currently trying to trying to work on like all the all my games those are all the games I currently try to work on why I'm playing you know it's a lot of games it keeps me busy keeps my mind occupied it keeps me you know away from doing the bad stuff I used to do so I'm kind of glad I have that and uh, God Wars God Wars Future Path. It's pretty good. It's kind of like a strategy uh, RPG, turn-based strategy RPG. It's, it's it's pretty good. It's okay. It's a low-budget game. It's made by NIS America, and I like that company too. I'm starting to really like them. I like a lot of their stuff. Uh, there's another one of their NIS America games, Grand Kingdom. That's a that's a really good game too. They're really fun. Uh, this is a pretty good tactics game. Shadow Tactics is a strategy action game. Really cool. Now, the uh, graphics ain't super great in this, but you kind of got to use your imagination. But the strategy is really good, and it's really fun, especially when you when strategy start working out the way you planned it. And it's it's kind of awesome. I love the ninja in it. He's awesome, the shinobi. You know, say it right. See, he's a shinobi. You know, instead of saying the American word like the ninja, the English word ninja, it's actually a shinobi. Is what they're really called. Uh, and I got Pillars of Eternity. That's a great Obsidian game. It's really cool. It's kind of like Boulder's Gate and uh, games like that. It's like isometric top-down view it's pretty cool uh it's kind of aggravating on the ps4 but it's not too bad Crouch controls ain't that bad but it, it's kind of aggravating it's been better it's better probably when you play it on the computer uh pillars of the earth it's a good story game uh i don't like i said i don't have internet so i only have like the first i think five chapters on the disc and you have to get all you have to get the seven the other three or four you have to download them, so, but it's got a free code if you get it new to get all the chapters. But I can't do it because I don't have internet right now. I got Skyrim, uh, the special edition. Uh, just I, I used to have it on PS3, and I, you know I just so I just got it again for PS4 because I just play PS4 because. I, it's where I mainly sit in my room, and it's like on well, my bigger TV, you know. So that's where I normally play is like my PS4. Uh, my PS3 is like over there on my little area with my PS2. Uh, I didn't know if like anybody like kind of seen seen the. Oh, sorry, dropped my phone. I'm kind of clumsy today. I don't really, I ain't like a hundred percent like running good. I'm kind of sick today, so sorry. Uh, hopefully y'all could see the, it's kind of dusty and everything, but there's PlayStation 2 and my PS3's over there in the corner. That's my little PS2 area and PS3 area, sorry. Like all running around, jumping all over the bed and everything like an idiot. Persona, Persona 5. Never really was into Persona. Didn't really know what it was about until I started getting into Shin Megami Tensei stuff. And didn't even know Persona was a part of it till uh, about a few months ago. 
play, started playing it. I kind of like it. I ain't beat it yet. I, I actually, I, no, I don't kind of like it. I really like it. It's a really good RPG. It's super fun. It's really uh, kind of unique story. Wolf Among Us. Really good Telltale game. A lot better than some of... Really good and a lot better than I thought it was going to be. Really awesome. Of course. Shadow of the Colossus remake. Awesome game. Just something I'm, I fiddle with it every once in a while. And I think I've got like four or five. I think I'm on my fifth Colossus i got to fight now. Um, Kingdom Come Deliverance. I haven't been playing it in a long time. But I, I got it recently. Because uh, I had it and then I sold it. Because I kind of needed some money. So I sold some of my games. Uh, but I got it back here recently. It, it's a really good game, but the, it's got little hiccups and problems. Uh, Dragon's Dogma. Dark Arisen version for PS4. Awesome, awesome game. Very, very cool. I just can't say anything, but it's cool. I got Days Gone. Pretty awesome game. My son likes playing this a little bit more than me. I, I, it's okay, but... It's, a, it's an okay game. It's kind of like a mediocre game. It's a middle of the road type game. Like it's like a, it's you know it's like a it's not a bad game. It's just I don't know how to say it. It's like a middle. It's kind of like one of those games. that's like a seven, six or seven type. If you're rating it, it's just kind of like a middle of the road type game. It's fun, but it's not like you know it's not the best thing ever but it's fun and it's not too it's you know there's nothing wrong with it it's just i kind of burn out on zombie games myself uh assassin's creed odyssey uh i was really i was like thinking about not getting this game but then because i was like i'm kind of done with assassin's creed i'm kind of like tired of it but this game was worth it. It was worth getting. And plus it was only like 20 bucks at Walmart. So I was like why not. Think about getting Origins. Because I heard Origins was kind of like similar to this. Like the play style and stuff. So I was like well I might get Origins too. And try it out. Valkyria Chronicles 4. Awesome game. First time I ever played a Valkyrie Chronicle. A Valkyrie game. This is awesome game. Very awesome. Horizon Zero, Zero Dawn Complete Edition. It's got all the DLC, uh, everything. Remothered Tormented Fathers. That's a pretty good survival horror game. Uh, Catherine, full body. Have the cat had Catherine on PS3. Had to get the full body just for the extra features. Just had to play it. I ain't beat it yet again, but I'm I'm working on it. Uh, Fist of the North Star, Lost Paradise, very cool action game, very fun. That's an awesome game. And it, I don't think it costs that much either. I think I got mine for like twenty something dollars, thirty on Amazon. I, I buy a lot of my games on Amazon. Uh, also, I got my From Software collection over here on my, this is my game kind of Care Bear bookcase that I use as a game case. It's uh, got it's all my games on my PlayStation 4s, on my PS3s, there's my animes and my movies, and I got more movies, and there's the Care Bears. I just, I had it, it's like a bookcase from when I was a kid, and I just turned it into a game case. Uh, where, where are my Dark Souls? There they are. There's all my Dark Souls and my European Bloodborne. I got the European version of Bloodborne because it's got the Old Hunters DLC on it so I could play the DLC. Since I don't have internet and I can't download it, I have to buy everything on physical. So it's the Game of the Year edition and it only come out in Europe for some reason. And... So I had to get it from Europe. I had to get the European version. Which it's very awesome. Very cool. It's uh, got, you know, uh, it's got Arabic writing on it. And, and all, you know, several different languages. But uh, that's 
pretty much it. I just wanted to kind of like make a video since I haven't made one in a while and I just figured I'd just make one on some of my game collection and kind of what games I'm kind of working on or playing, sort of. Some of them I don't play uh, every day. Uh, some games I do. And, uh, and then I just kind of like get tired of the ones I play every day and switch out and go back to an older title I haven't beat yet. It takes me sometimes a while to beat certain games because uh, they don't catch, if they don't like really catch my attention right away, I slowly work on them and I finally finish them after a while. But, you know, priorities, you gotta, you gotta get what tickles your fancy at done first, you know. But anyways, uh, that's it. So see you later.